Hey guys, my name is Luthias and I hope you had a great Christmas and I'm here to tell you guys about the winter sale. Now, there are a lot of sales right through the year, but I love the winter sales or the December sales because you get a lot of big savings on Steam, okay? I know there are other um, game sellers that you guys support and I'm, you know, I'm more than happy for you guys to support them. So use Steam and them as well. See where you, where you can get the most savings, but right here you can see up to 78, 80% off. And high, okay, 80%, yeah, it's even higher than 80%, but yeah, you can see, just look at all the green symbols, guys. A lot of great sales going on right now, so if you've got your Christmas money, you know, your parents gave you some money, or you got a bonus, or you're wondering what you, you know, what you want to buy your son, maybe you wanted a game, you know, that you couldn't afford, now you can, okay? And remember, uh, my pricing will be different, so let's not focus about the pri on the pricing. Let's just focus on the percentage that you get off and the quality of the game, okay? Now, this top 10 list of mine is going to be a bit biased, but of course, you guys are free to go get your, you know, go get your own selections. This is just the games that I've enjoyed, you know, over the past few years, and they are now at the perfect price, where I just think they are perfect. And of course, being biased, number one, the game that I cover is misgraded, okay? It's far from perfect, but I must tell you guys, it's the game that brought me back into gaming. It's got about an 87, you know, 78% um, review rate lately. It's built on the CryEngine, it's absolutely beautiful. Um, it's not extremely well optimized, but the experience is what me brought, what brought me back into gaming. And for a survival game, it's a very, very immersive experience. And the PvP is something that gets your heart pumping and your hands shaking constantly due to the fact that you get, that you have a lot to lose. Okay. As you play in the game, you get better gear, you build a base, you raid other players. Um, so it's a standard survival game, but the graphics and the immersion and the friends that you build up and the people that you meet, I feel Muscreated has got a very, very good community. And, um, yeah, I've loved this game for more than 3000 hours and definitely a steal at 50%. As I say, let's not look at the current, at my currency, but let's look at a 50% sale. It's a great offer. And then some, a game you all know, and at the moment, the company some of you might hate due to Fallout 76 and everything that's been going on there. But guys, that's the multiplayer side of it, okay? Um, let's just look at why we fell in love with Bethesda in the first place, and that is due to Fallout 3, okay? I have loved Fallout from Fallout 1 to Vegas, um, all the Fallout games, okay? And Fallout 3 was definitely my favorite, but Fallout 4 was still a very, very good experience. And with the expansion packs, I think you guys are going to have a heck of a lot of fun. Um, it's at a good price. It's one of the top sellers in 2019. It's still got great reviews. Remember, they flourish at single-player experiences. And when you look at the NPCs that you can interact with and the beautiful world and the characters, and how you can build up your character, and how you've got freedom to do whatever you want. I know some might say Fallout 4 is a bit linear, and they've got other complaints about it, but I never let a game, you know, box me in, and you can go wherever you want. You don't need to follow the storyline, go play on the new survival mode, put off your vets, you know, and um, just... Just go wild, okay? Play it realistically. It's still a fantastic game. 70% off is a complete steal. And yeah, extremely great experience for, you know, if you've never experienced Fallout uh, before. As you can see the reviews there, it is a fantastic game if you can just get Fallout 76, you know, out of the back of your mind and realize, you know, that these guys really came through for us when we needed something special. So, you know, we still have to give them a lot of credit for that. Then, one game that I haven't put a lot of time into, but clearly you guys can see the best of 2019, most played, 92% reviews, positive reviews, 
a lot of people love this game and I want to do a series on it at some point. Um, unfortunately, graphics is something that I'm very interested in. Okay, the, the way the game looks is very important to me. Um, but the, the times that I have played it, it has immersed me. The sounds are great. The possibilities, you know, um, are endless. You've got a lot of freedom. Again, a very nice community. You've got every seven days mutants attack you, okay? Your base, or if you haven't got a base, they come after you. Nights are, of course, much more dangerous than during the daytime. The building system is, you know, very free with what you can do. Um, yeah, so if you look on YouTube, you'll see there's a lot of possibilities. And 66% off, guys, it's a clump complete steal at the moment and they have worked on it you can see there they are working on this game constantly and again if you haven't got a great pc this is the game for you boys this is the game for you okay a lot of us don't have the money to um you know build up ferraris and we need to look at games like this now grand theft auto has always been one of my favorites i played gta 3 a ton i finished gta 4 probably three times gta 5 the single player experience lost me a bit but you guys must remember i'm you know i'm an old school gamer and um, so i'm i'm you know i'm not from the young crew really but still 50 percent off my son has enjoyed this game a lot Um you can play together online it is it is very action-packed. Rockstars are one of the, or Rockstars, one of the leading game developers at the moment, you know, with, with Witcher and, um, Red Dead Redemption 2. So everything is quality. Um, there's been a bunch of improvements, constant new stuff that comes in and a you know, very, very fun experience. I must say, I think you can enjoy it seriously, but I think it's, a bit more aimed at the younger crowd and like i say everyone i know um you know 30 below 25 below especially 20 and below okay um kids that are still in school although you know, and there's not a lot of violence so you know you might have your your issues with the with <laughs> people out there that are very funny there's a lot of, there's a lot of fun guys um i haven't put a ton of time into it but again it's a great price for the quality that you get rockstar is a great quality company and yes this is this is again a fantastic deal best top seller for 2019 as you guys can see people are having fun and you know um there's just a heck of a lot to do in the game. And again, you've got the freedom to do whatever you want, which for me is a very, very important aspect in a game. So yes, um, my son is crazy about it. His friends are crazy about it. And I, I have played three and four and I'll definitely give it a go because the price makes sense to me. And yeah. Even at my old age, I can see what's so special about it. A game that some of you might have missed is Mad Max. Okay. Um, it's a game that I have almost finished um, due to certain reasons. I don't know if I had to format my PC or whatever the case may be. But um, yeah, I enjoyed my time with this game and it's almost like the Batman series when it comes to the fi fighting mechanics, which is really cool. Um, I think the graphics will still hold up. It's 2015, yeah, so I'm sure the graphics will hold up. It's not really, um, system intensive, so I think you can set it, you know, set the graphics up to max. Um, it's got a story. It has got a real Mad Max feeling. So for all you old school gamers, you know, it's really something that I enjoyed. I didn't enjoy the Batman series such a lot. Um, but this, this one, you know, seems to grip me longer. And yeah, I like, um, upgrading the car. Um, there are some aspects of it that, you know, like most of these kinds of games, when it comes to missions, um, some of them feel, you know, more or less the same. But again, it's not PC intensive. 
And I mean, more games, more achievements, just more fun. Okay, and this is definitely one to put on your list. It's very, very cheap, 75% off, very positive reviews. So, no negatives. Then, a, a game that I really enjoy playing with my son. Again, best uh, you know, in the top sellers of 2019. Very positive reviews. 60% off. Really, guys, for the work that they have put into this game, um, you're getting it for a bargain. I mean, even without the 60% off, I still feel it's a bargain. With the 60% off, it's a heck of a bargain. I've seen my son play this game that my jaw was hanging open. The amount of skill that you can get in this game is insane. Your, um, the area awareness, like you've got certain, you've got various maps, like a house with the terrorists, you know, and then the cops or the SWAT team, and then you've got um, an airplane hostage situation. You've got various hostage situations. But the more you play those maps, the more when you hear someone, you'll know where they are. And that is what makes this game so insane for me, is that if you play enough, I'm not talking about the guys using unfair advantages. We know they are flooding the market. But when, when I see pure skillers, when I don't think about aim bots and, you know, all the hacks that... 30% of the population is using. When I see a play, player using his hearing to understand where the players are, it's fantastic. And it's really, really a great game, guys. Buy it, no questions asked. Witcher 3, one of my favorites for the year. I've watched the Witcher series, freaking awesome. And, <laughs> oh, I mean, it says overwhelmingly positive, guys, but... 250,000 people, 97% of them liked it, okay? That is insane, okay? It doesn't even matter. Uh, unmissable, you know? This is the first time a trailer actually talks the truth. Now, unfortunately, I'm not a real fantasy um, fan, you know? I'm more old school, real, you know? Um, but after I've watched the series those sparks have come alive again and the fact that i can get the witcher now at 70 percent off is amazing one of the best games ever made now i mean i don't think they're blowing their own horn you know it's over overwhelmingly positive it's cg project red the same guys that are going to bring us cyberpunk 2077 these guys now to create a story know how to immerse you and although I don't like the fantasy and the magic that G uh, Geralt uses with Henry Cavill in The Witcher, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to buy this game. I'm going to buy the Game of the Year edition. It's still a freaking steal, boys. It's a steal. If you think how much work went into the Wild Hunt, you know, and the expansions and the amount of hours that you can put into it, I mean, it's, it would be ridiculous not to jump on this bus. And this is definitely one of the bigs for this year. Watch the, watch the series, get into that game, okay? Now, my last three are hidden gems. Games that I really appreciate, made by small companies that's getting better all the time. And the first one is Wreckfest. Now, I used to be a big flat out fan, okay? The, the, the normal Grand Prix and Project Cars and Assault and those kinds of games. Like Dirt, I really enjoyed, but the other games get, gets, you know, it doesn't really excite me. And the amount of time that I have, I really need to, you know, feel I'm enjoying myself. And I love playing this with my son. Kids love breaking things, you know. So this Wreckfest, you know, is definitely something they enjoy. They, they will enjoy driving you off the road, you know, or crashing into you. They'll definitely have a lot of fun with you. And it's something that you can enjoy alone as well. You don't have to, it's not something that you can play for three hours or four hours, you know, nonstop. I really enjoy it if I put a half an hour or an hour in every now and then, you know. And every time I go on, I enjoy it. It's relaxing. It's a lot of fun. I can play it with my son. We can have a family day. We would just wreck each other. And they're working on the game permanently. Again, it's 60% off. It's very positive at the moment with the reviews. It's a really good price and they're working on it constantly. So remember, you buy it now and 
they keep working on it okay so it's just a good investment you can see there the reviews are extremely good and the community likes it as well so yeah it's a really great game and yeah really something that i personally like and then one of the hidden gems for this year for next year is walson now it's coming out in full release um next year it's been in early access for about three years yeah yeah i'd say about three years and something that is that that i really enjoy um from the first hour i've played it i found it very challenging um the graphics was wonderful um and yes i love diablo yes i love titan quest you know and various other games but this this one stands out for me because it feels i always wanted a titan quest 2 now i can't get a titan quest 2 but this one feels like an upgraded titan quest it's a really cheap price but not only the cheap price guys next year when it comes out in full release they are going to up the price i don't know by how much it could be three times more it could be four times more uh, but this is what makes this game a good buy at the moment, okay? Because they are going to bring us various acts. Um, you can level up to level 90. The graphics are wonderful. It's on a special now, okay? But it's not only the special that you must think about. It's the future as well. When they bring it out in full release, they're going to up the price. And yeah, it would be a really good idea for you guys to jump in now. A game that I really, really want to buy before the 2nd of January is Hunt Showdown because I'm a Cry Engine fan. And although it's, and I love playing with, with, with one person, okay, I don't really like big crowds. So a strategic PvP fantasy kind of, you know, game is really something that um, appeals to me. I know the graphics are always great. Um, so I know I won't be disappointed by that. And you the fact that I can lose my character if I die um, adds that fear element to, to me, which I really, really love. I love it when I'm fighting and I've got something to lose. It's only 35% off. It's probably one of the highest priced games when it comes to a small company, okay? So the, the price is just, you know, everything is great for me. It's just that price that I'm thinking, you know, if you just got 30% lower, you know, if you if if you just went 30% lower, um, even on the sale, um, you know, then it's something that I would really go for. There's a lot of challenges in the game. Um, they also up updating it, you know, updating it, and it's in full release. But I'm sure, you know, they're gonna bring a few things in. It's got very difficult challenges, as you can see. And yes, definitely my last hidden gem um, out of the three. And yes, that is basically the 10 games that I feel are fantastic investments for 2020. And not only because how great they are, and I, I mean, you could see all the, all the reviews were extremely positive, overwhelmingly positive. Then we had that break back, um, you know, that fantastic Witcher 3 um, that we want to go into. I'd love to play Red Re Dead Redemption 2, but at the moment I'm on a tight budget. You know, I can't really rip out that amount of money. So maybe in two or three years, we can do a winter sale again and we can, you know, jump into that one. If you guys have got money for Red Dead Redemption 2, go for it, boys. You know, but this is about all about the winter sale and how important you know how important it is for you guys to save money think about it let's say dollars if the game costs 50 dollars okay then and you get it at 80 percent discount that's 10 dollars you are saving 40 dollars per game okay paying 50 or 60 dollars for a game is hectic but you know it's not it's not that hectic if you only pay 10 dollars so if you thought, hey, I could buy that $50 game, rather buy five ten dollars games. And 2nd of January, boys. 2nd of January, please. Remember, 2nd of January. 2nd of January. So yes, guys. 
2nd of January. If you enjoyed this video, um, do me a favor and click that like button. You know, if you want to see some of the Invis games in next year, gameplays, and you know, I'm going to show various of those games because I'm going to buy it myself. Click the subscribe button because I am going to be doing series on it. I am going to be doing a Fallout series with a few twists and turns. Um, which I think will be very unique and very fun. So click that bell button to be notified of future videos. And I hope, hope some of you really make a plan, you know, and give yourself something fun to do next year instead of just working your butt off. Hope you have a wonderful new year and see you guys next time. Cheers.